Hi guys, welcome back to another update of Malvern Junction. Uh, just to let you guys know that I put the braces in today. They're all screwed in as well at the back. Even these ones as well. They're all screwed in. I've done all the way up to, as you all know, up to here. I'm just planning out of how big the station is. I've got the station plan. That's true, right? So there's platforms. Uh, this is where the bridge is going to be, headed to Worcester. And over here is supposed to be over towards um, Hereford. But I'm starting to. This is the third plan that I came out with. This is supposed to be on Worcestershire Shop Hill. Uh, Worcester Shop Hill, sorry. Going to Worcester, Fulgate Street, and that way it's going up to uh, George Street Spa. So, I'm keeping this as it is with these tracks. I'm going to have these as uh, express points, so I'm going to find those if I can. Hopefully, fingers crossed, can find two of them. Um, because this won't be here. This will be extended out a bit, so that point will meet along this line here. So I'll have more length for the yard to store the drawings, if that makes sense. So yeah, this is what I've got planned, and this is what I'm going to do. So I'm just uh, having a look, because I'm going to make 45 degree angle braces to come out up to here. and go up to that line there. And it's going to hold this lot and I might just put a couple of legs on I don't know yet but I'll see what I can do I might have to put a couple of legs on and then I'm going to have it I don't know if it's have it 6 inches or 6.5 and because these come out about uh, 2.5 inches apart but I'm going to see what I can do I'm going to get um, a double track level crossing to go somewhere in this area because I'm going to have a uh, Newland East, which is going to have a single box level crossing, and it's going to have um, these two points to go in like that. I'm not going to use them, but that's just there uh, how Newland East is. So the signal box is just around about here, and then the level crossing is around about here ish. So that's looking good. And I'll get the level crossing if I can. If I can get one of the a really good con condition that is either used or second hand, well, second hand or not being used. I'll see if I can sort that, otherwise, I've got to pay out for a brand new one. So, that's it, then, guys. I'm just going to quickly tidy up because I've got to put all these lots somewhere just along here, or probably in the lift there, to add that box out, just put it somewhere for now. Tidying my, my bed up a bit, take the rubbish out as well. And then I'm going to have some dinner. And then this will be cleared up by next week as well. So I've got this UP loco. I've asked somebody if they're interested in my UP loco and they said they're interested in this one. So they will stay next week. I'm going to get the money for that. And that will go towards buy one or two things I need on here. <laughs> so there you go. In track wise. So I'm going to get some track. I'm going to get some straight lines as well if I can. Uh, next Thursday, so I'm looking forward to that, and I'm going to see what I can try and do. I'm going to build some more um, of the framework as well. I might just make a start on that before I head over to here because I don't know on here if it's going to come out six inches or foot. I'm going to have a think about that. Then I'm going to work out how the curve is going to come around here. So you've got the curves of the, uh, the tracks and the board because to get through here it's going to be a bit of a tight squeeze I want to be able to walk in and out without having any sharp edges to dig into my sides. So there we go. Any more updates that I've done I'll let you guys know and I'll stick it on my channel and uh, let me know what you think as well. Thank you guys for watching and see you all again soon. Take care for now. Have a wonderful uh, bank holiday weekend. Thank you guys. See you all again soon. Thanks very much for watching.